finally got my turn. <laughs> when I'm on the program with Bob English, this is usually the way it happens. <laughs> I'm usually last. <laughs> uh, I'd like to introduce Jim Henry, who is a representative of the students, and he has a few words to say. Or maybe no words. <laughs> Would all the students who contributed to this gift please stand? <laughs> Dr. English, your students can never fully, fully express how thankful we are for you. Not only have you been a dedicated and devoted teacher, but you have genuinely cared for us as individuals. This gift is our thanks to you. I still have my turn. <laughs> uh, Bob English wears many hats. He's appreciated for many reasons. <laughs> Probably Santa is quite appropriate. <laughs> The friends, <laughs> the friends and colleagues here tonight have shown their appreciation in various ways, and Joan McMahon has a symbol of appreciation also. For those of you who did send remembrances for Bob, uh, this is a sort of a symbol of the remembrances that you've said. I do have others that I decided not to carry tonight. <laughs> <laughs> but in here, I have put the letters and the pictures and the um, sometimes uh, funny memories that all of you have shared. And if any of you wish to contribute others, I do have other scrapbooks <laughs> waiting, Bob, from all of us. <laughs> okay. Uh, you may open the student's gift. What? You can open the student's gift. Oh. <laughs> 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 I'm not going to try to read it all. I'll do it after midnight. <laughs> call me, Bob, and I'll relay it. <laughs> I haven't, but I've heard about it. 
But they wanted to. It's it's two minutes after nine. <laughs> <laughs> Bob, in ardent admiration of your theatrical skills demonstrated by one, recitation of Shakespeare throughout the halls of PSU, <laughs> two, the jazziest speech language clinician this side of the Rockies, <laughs> and three, the ability to enact the role of a grouch when you're really a softy at heart. <laughs> We would like to nominate you for the biggest ham around town award. <laughs> the following gifts reflect this honor. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Open it. <laughs> save that. Yeah, save it for your <laughs> <laughs> For those of you who can't see it, it's a honey baked ham. party now when you're not fully retired. The next present answers your question. You'll only be teaching one class per term which give you lots of extra time. Just think. Fewer preparation and advising hours. We all want you to enjoy that time so we're giving you two options to choose from. You got this one. <laughs> <laughs> you may choose <laughs> and all expenses paid one week trip to Cannon Beach staying at the beautiful Surf View Motel Hotel your room will be situated right on the ocean with a view of Haystack stack Rock. You have access to a sauna, swimming pool, fireplace, and hot and cold running maids. <laughs> <laughs> or, <laughs> you may choose to sail to Alaska on the love boat where a significant portion of the fare is already paid. <laughs> One way. One way. <laughs> <laughs> After tonight, you will receive a tape of the retirement party. The tape will also include you, your November presentation on AM Northwest. Oh, <laughs> 